Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you for another day. Thank you for your beauty. Thank you for all things bright and beautiful. Thank you for the creations of of your hands. Thank you for the birds that sing. Thank you for a beautiful weather. Thank you for the sunshine. Thank you for the rain. Thank you for life. Hallelujah. I'll be sharing with us today the scripture from the word of God, Proverbs 19 verse 1. Better a poor man whose work is blameless than a fool whose lips are power. Verse. It, it is not good. It says it is not good to have zeal without knowledge, nor to be harshly amused the way. A man's own folly ruins his life, yet his heart rages against God. Hallelujah. We don't want to be a, a fool. We don't want to rage against God. If God has said this is the way, follow the way. You may not find it convenient. You must follow the way as a child of God because it's not about staying in your comfort zone you make a move if you want the beautiful things and the good things of life it is not by staying in one place and not exercising your muscles your spiritual muscles you got to make a move you've got to go through some things you've got to work some things out so i emphasize that part of this scripture that says a man's own folly ruins his life because you are just considered with a position it's ignorance because oh i'm comfortable no it can't be that way he goes on to say he says yet the man's heart reaches against god you are angry oh god what's happening here but it's all about you who is not making a move look at god's word in proverb 19 and 1 the latter part of it and discipline your body and say i'm moving from point a to b i'm putting myself through that challenge because i want to lay hold on greater glory Challenge yourself today. You can do all things. Bye for now.